Welcome. How are you doing today? We got some cowsies. Sorry, my nose is really itchy. My skin is fucking dry. This is what we're here to talk about today is my dry ass skin. One of my knuckles is bleeding. What did I do? Nothing. I, I went to go pee before I left the house. And when I was done, I looked down and my hand was bleeding. I guess I ripped open my flesh on my very rough pants. So in older videos, I used to talk about my job and I do not do that anymore um, because it's not interesting. And y'all don't need to know all that. I work in a fucking office. Who'd care? So my office used to have a paper towel dispenser in the restroom. We do not have that anymore. We have a blow dryer for your hands. And uh, after a couple of weeks, like, I couldn't fucking take it anymore, dude. Like, my skin was just, like, torn, scabbed, chapped, shredded from blow drying my fucking hands multiple times a day. So I took a roll of paper towels from the break room and I left it in the bathroom. And now, here's where I think I fucked up. There's this much older woman in my office who talks really fucking loudly and her cubicle is um, on the other side of mine. So we're both facing the same wall and I just have to hear this woman all day long, just talking. She always used to fucking scare the shit out of me because I would like go outside to smoke a cigarette and she would like appear out of nowhere and be like, hi. And I'd be like, oh my God. I didn't come out here to talk to you. Mind your business, ma'am, with your loud ass. Anyway, so I was in there washing my hands, and she came out of the stall and was washing her hands. And I don't know why people want to talk to their coworkers in the fucking bathroom, but she decided to do that to me. And uh, I had grabbed a paper towel to dry my hands. And she said, oh, my gosh, I'm so glad that they put a roll of paper towels in here. And I said, I did that. I couldn't fucking take it anymore. My skin is shredded. I cannot do any more of the blow drying. I think the bitch ratted me out. Cause unless they were like watching security camera footage, there was nobody who saw me grab that roll of fucking paper towels. And I don't think I was the only one. Because somebody ended up putting my roll of paper towels in this like little cabinet area. And when I looked into the cabinet to get a paper towel yesterday, there was an additional roll of paper towels that I did not bring into that bathroom. Well, because my office doesn't mm, allow me to eat uh, popsicles, I don't know why. But that was a thing a couple years ago. I got a stern email about how I am no longer to eat popsicles at work. Okay. It's the most dick I've sucked in years, come on. Your husband's next. Anyway, so mid-afternoon on Friday at work, I got an email from my manager. The subject was paper towels. And the preview line just said like, Per so-and-so, who's our big boss, the president of the company's wife, you are not to take paper towels into the bathroom. That is why the hand dryer has been installed. Is this really such a fucking issue that, like, they had to have a conversation about it and then, like, email me that I can't dry my hands with fucking paper towels that the company provides for us to use to dry our hands in the break room? And I was so annoyed with it when I saw the email come in because I have two monitors at my desk. One is for like things that I'm doing and the other one is just for uh, my email inbox so I can like monitor it. But I was so frustrated and annoyed because I've been with the company for over five years and they have from time to time do some shit like this. And I just feel like, what the fuck, man? My skin is fucking destroyed right now. Like, was it really that big of a problem that I wanted to dry my hands with a paper fucking towel? 
And no, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I didn't reply to the email on Friday because Fridays are my bus- busiest day. So I, I figured like, okay, I'll give myself a couple of days to like think about it and how I want to respond Cause I, um, you know, sometimes you get an email and you just want to fucking hurl your keyboard into the next cubicle and walk out of the building because the email you got was just annoying. Uh, Yeah, I genuinely don't see why it was such a, and I'm pretty sure somebody else brought paper towels in there because yeah, same fucking issue. Our hands are fucked up, especially since it's winter. I'm not. Hand blow dryers are, like, the stupidest fucking thing in the world. I know. Resources, trees, paper towels, blah, blah, blah. But, like, dude, I ripped my skin open and didn't even notice it while I was just buttoning my fucking pants. And since I started using the paper towels, like, my scabs have mostly gone away. But, like, my hands look like like some fucking gross old lady hands. My, sh- my skin tears really fucking easily. Like, did they... Did my bosses think that I don't know how to use a hand dryer? Is that, is that the tea here? So I think I'm going to tell them, all right, sorry, my hands are fucked up, so I'll just bring a towel from home. Anyway, that shit just got on my nerves. It's a stupid, stupid thing, but that's, uh, that's what it is. So I'm going to Target. I need to buy an outfit to wear to my sister's rehearsal dinner this Friday. And I probably need to look at some shoes to wear to the wedding. I want to thank you for listening. I feel like Forgiveness is very important, so I want you to forgive yourself for the time that you have wasted watching this video. And have a good day. Fucking paper towels, dude. Really? Come on.